Jake Edwin Charles Kennedy. Um, whose opinion do you value the most when it comes to music? Um, from everyone, really. I think there's always something to learn from from everyone, whether the opinion's right or wrong. I think so. There's not there's not one person I'd look to for for an opinion, really. So I was just wondering if there's somebody who you sort of play things to and just find out what they. Oh well, in um, in that in that case, I usually um, yeah, I usually play my music to my friends and stuff. And like, mm -hmm. if like you know, if like nine out of my ten friends say it's uh, it's a bad song, then I'm I'm gonna assume that it's probably not that great. So I base it on averages more than anything. I read once that you talked about this girl that you saw in the audience. Um, who was singing along your songs, but in school she always used to say, why do you listen to that shy? <laughs> yeah, pretty much, yeah. Um, yeah, she's, uh, she's a bit of a fan now, which is funny. She always, like, uh, she said, uh, yeah, I never listen to, to the kind of music you make. And then, yeah, she was, um, she was in the crowd singing along on somebody's shoulders, singing to all the words, I found it. And you got to play with one of your favourite drummers, uh, James Gadsden. Can you describe that? Yeah, it was amazing, yeah. Like, uh, he's, like, my favourite drummer. And... And uh, he came. He came by the studio and I uh, uh, said hello. And he was really nice, really nice guy. And I told, I said to him, I, I said, uh, I've always wanted to use the, uh, to, wanted to learn the drum beat for, but with the song, use me. And he was like, Oh, I'll show you. So he took me over to the kit and started me sh showing me the beat. I still can't play it, but, uh, but I thought it you was. You had a uh, good teacher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess I, I think it's only him and um, and on my second album, Chad Smith played drums and he 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 showed me a couple of things. So. Uh, they're pretty, pretty two good guys to learn a few drumming skills. Bloody from, so. <laughs> so, who else would you sort of like to collaborate or have to play with? With Mike D from the Beastie Boys again. I did on the last record, but um, unfortunately we didn't get anything. So, I was I went and um, did some writing with him this time, and I think we got a, a couple of good songs out of it. Hopefully, when I record them, they'll sound okay. So we'll see. Um, I once read that you that you read the comments on Twitter. Um, and, and have a laugh. Do you still do you still read them? Because people comment like you're a grumpy guy, and you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sometimes I like. Yeah, sometimes some of them are funny. I can't remember. What, 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 I think one guy said that I sounded like a, a wasp under a plastic cup, which I found pretty funny. I thought that was really good. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get to see anybody yesterday? No, I didn't know, unfortunately. Um, there was a Champions League final, so. Oh, you're a bit of a football fan as well. Yes, yeah. of course. Yeah. Have you got any secret talents? Uh, I play a lot of football. Um, that's not really a secret, is it? Well, it's a secret that I score every and every game I play in. <laughs> <laughs> not really, that's okay. not true, that's a lie. <laughs>